Hey everyone, Shoebox Legends, thanks for joining me today for another video. Uh, today's episode will be a relatively short one, uh, nice and quick. This will be an in the mailbox segment, which uh, as the name implies, contains a card that I just uh, plucked from my own mailbox uh, in, the, in the very uh, recent past. In this case, uh, this one just arrived today. So uh, excited about this, it came from Canada, so it took uh, a little bit of time to arrive. Uh, but it is not a hockey card, which you might have guessed uh, after you, you heard me say that. This is a baseball card. And essentially, the, the quick backstory here is that I sold a soccer card recently uh, that was part of a, a lot that I bought and had pretty good luck with. Um, so I, I got a decent uh, return for this card. And it just so happened that on the day I sold it, the card that you're going to see today went up for sale at almost the exact price point down to a penny of, of what I uh, recouped from the sale of the soccer card. So I uh, figured it was a, a nice coincidence and a good opportunity to add today's card to my collection and jumped on it. So you can sort of think of this as a one-for-one -for -one trade where I, I traded the, the soccer card for the card we're going to look at now. So here it is uh, from the 2019 Topps Chrome set. This is the Green Wave Refractor of Fernando Tatis Jr. Uh, obviously, I think anybody watching this video Unless you've been living in a cave for the last couple of years, you, you obviously know who this guy is. Uh, one of the biggest names in the game, just signed a huge, uh, extremely long contract to remain with San Diego. And I think uh, there are a, a ton of collectors out there, myself included, who are very, very uh, interested and intrigued to see how uh, Tatis pans out this coming year and, and what kind of a season he turns in. So uh, this is a second year card. Obviously, this is not a rookie card. His rookie cards were in the 2019 releases. But nonetheless, I, I think he's one of those players with, you know, enough credibility and, and name recognition and star power that, you know, even his second and third year cards are are cool to pick up. Um, aside from that, you know, I'm, I'm really a collector first and foremost, more than an investor. And I just really love the look of wave refractors. Uh, I have ever since I first encountered them years back. And uh, in this case, this this green wave refractor is uh, serial numbered. Um, so these are out of 99 uh, copies, which you can see there in the upper right. Um, and yeah, I mean, that's, that's really all I have to say about this. I, I don't really need to summarize, I think, st uh, Tatis's statistics or why he's seen as an exciting player here. Uh, I do have some other Tatis cards, including a few rookies that I'll, I'll plan to show here on the channel at some point in the future. But uh, for today, uh, like I said, I figured this would just make a, a good, quick, uh, dirty one one card video, a uh, nice, quick episode, and really just wanted to kind of show this uh, this gem off. Uh, happy to have it. Always love the the tops rookie cup cards. Uh, they're just they're they're great, and to me, they they carry a little bit of an extra appeal, and they make us a, a second year card like this one uh, even a little bit more attractive than it would be otherwise. So. Uh, yeah, that's that's really all for today. I hope you enjoyed uh, this pickup. Like I said, I'll, I'll share some more of my, my small Tatis collection in the future, but I uh, hope you enjoyed it. And if you have any comments, as always, you know, feel free to, to drop one below, hit the like button, subscribe, or, or reach out. Um, looking to uh, interact with more co collectors and grow my network. So uh, look forward to hearing from you, and uh, we'll be back soon with more content. Thanks.